So hello and welcome friends to our channel Intro Mac and here we discuss about basic mechanical engineering concepts. So guys we have started our new series regarding fixture designing and what are the principles in designing a fixture. So in our previous session we have seen different kind of mechanical clamps. So today we will see the mechanical clamping devices part 3 which is the cam action clamps. So please do watch the video until end. Do subscribe the channel and press the bell icon for getting the updates from the channel so without wasting time let's get started now let's see what are the cam action clamps so cam action clamps are very similar to the vertical clamps but the clamping force is generated not by the toggle linkage but the action of the roller or the cam so let's see how they work so here we have the vertical action uh, cam clamp so you could see we have a workpiece over here we have a stud and we have this cam shape right so because of this shape and the action the force is getting applied over here now let's see how so when i lift this lever up this is getting unclamped and when i move this down the part is getting clamped you can see over here now what is the advantage of this is you can easily lock and unlock the part the time of locking and unlocking is saved as compared to the strap clamps right so this is the vertical action clamp why because the clamp is uh, moving up and down right in this plane right now let's see another example of horizontal action clamp now here you could see the workpiece and then we have moving this lever and because of that this clamp is simultaneously moving like in forward and downward direction simultaneously and causing the clamping of the part you can observe over here right so the lever is moving in the horizontal plane so that's why it is a horizontal action clamp you can see how the forces are getting applied over here the workpiece is there and now I am moving this lever the part is getting clamped so this is horizontal action clamp right now let's see how we can select or how we can choose this clamp how we can order these clamps readily so here uh, we are on the Misumi side and Misumi is a manufacturer of different kind of parts and you can get a huge amount of different parts you could see over here right now what we want we want the cam clamps so let's type the cam clamp over here and let's search now here you could get different kind of items over here you could see cams center uh, clamp set then clamp lever you can only get the levers also then different kind of lever options are available or there you can just buy the accessories only and you can manufacture other parts now let's see cam center clamp set now here cam center clamp set you can read the different parameters over here the dimensions the directions the oh the orientation how much space it will take so many dif different things are mentioned over here what is the overall dimensions because these things are important while designing a fixture because how much place it takes that is also an important thing right because you should know uh, the size of the clamp it should not hinder with the part now another make we have keep make so we can also have the clamps from this make now let's see cam clamps this is the double action clamp right material you can see what is the clamp lever material stamp material and then here we have the handle force fh is the handle force and then we have this handle and f that indicates the force which is getting generated that is the holding force or you can say the clamping force right so other dimensions are mentioned now this is the graph which is very important which is the hand force versus the application of force right now you can see this graph if say you applied a hand force of 50 newton you are getting the force of 500 newton that is the clamping force right so this is the graph uh, which indicates how much force you will get over here right now let's see 
the other parameters the other dimensions of the clamp here you will get all the dimensions the heights and the different things over here right so this is about the cam clamps right so this is about the keep and let's see Voltra these offer different kind of clamps and uh, you can have the horizontal action clamps or here you can see the material what is the handle material finish and let's see what it offers it offers the low profile quick action clamps with jaw that pivots forward and downward we have seen that how it works like it moves simultaneously forward and then downward to clamp the job like right? so it locks the positively position and the handle turns in 180 degrees so the extended version is also available for the positioning on the machine bed so these are the dimensions of the clamp you can see what are the different dimensions of the clamp because that matters a lot you should check that whether this clamp is getting fitted or your fixture it has a sufficient space and here are the details the what are the stud size uh, used and what are the other dimensions uh, over here right you can download the CAD file also so this is about the horizontal action clamps and how you can order them what are the parameters and all those things so this is it about the cam action cla camps and I hope you liked the video and you got some idea about the cam action clamps. So if you have any doubts, please do write into the comment section and we can discuss over there. Until then keep intro making and we will meet in the next section. Thank you for the patient listening. Thank you.